So let's go ahead and discuss this. Why is everybody in the uproar? I'm confused. Is it shock value based upon the fact that the roles have been reversed and this is a woman pursuing a man? Because you know we have hundreds of thousands of stories of men that pursued women and eventually they wore the woman down, the woman grew on them. Before we get into that, Hey, what's good everybody? This is Glass. You are here for another third episode of Bit of That Man. So check me out. If this your first time watching this episode, hit that button, turn the bell notifications on. Go ahead and chime back because I got previous content for show that's relatable. And this is coming from the number one vlogger based out of Yeah, for real, H time. Let's go ahead and get to some nice episode. I'm talking about A. The internet is buzzing about Toby and Fats, our story. It's a five part series that's on YouTube and it's on Toby and Fat. Toby Nguingue from the H been rapping doing his thing who has really become a very big name in the rap game and has connected himself with the right people. He's doing everything 100% independent. He living, he shining, he keeping his family close, his friends, his queen, and he's staying blessed. But now all of a sudden the story is going viral about him and Fat. How they met, how they got together, how they broke up, the evaluation and the road and their own individual process. It's a five part series. All in all, it's probably close to 30 minutes. If you get time, I definitely recommend that you watch it. So let's go ahead and discuss this. Why is everybody in the uproar? I'm confused. Is it shock value based upon the fact that the roles have been reversed and this is a woman pursuing a man? Because you know we have hundreds of thousands of stories of men that pursued women and eventually they wore the woman down, the woman grew on them. Before we get into that, let's talk about this. The friend zone was created for women to place men within a certain category and for those men to really realize that this woman she ain't feeling you, she don't see you like that, she wanna be friend, brother, homie, whatever. She don't want you to be her boo, her dude, her main, she don't want any of that. But she don't necessarily give you the bullet to the head, she's gonna put you in the friend zone. Somebody watching this video right now, you've been putting the friend zone. You might be married or have children with somebody that friends on you at first, and then eventually she went through stuff, dude that she liked, that fell through, somebody else that she thought was 100 cheating on her, and you was sticking around and you was playing your position, and all of a sudden, boom, then you fall in the mix and you hit the jackpot. This ain't no different. I just seen that Alicia Keys did an interview and she said that Swiss Beats wasn't her type. But after Swiss did whatever his thing was, he wore her down. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the fact that eventually my daddy remained persistent enough and time and fate had it to where whoever my mama was dealing with it didn't pan out and my daddy was still in the picture still trying still working he won my mama over here goes glass there go my older sister some people have an issue with the time frame in which they were involved broke up got back together some people feel that that five year time frame is too long the average get together break off fall off she didn't see him as this he was doing him everybody trying to work on them the average of that is two to three years out the gate immediately and then depending on courtship and things like that so this whole five year gap really isn't a huge deal or let's look at it like this since they've been together engaged married they're seeing their dreams come true they have done some of the greatest things together that they wouldn't have individually done they have a family i'm not even checking their pockets but i'm pretty sure they can go where they want and do what they want he has always been a hundred percent devoted to her and vice versa ladies is that worth it is that potentially worth the sacrifice are you willing to put your ego to the side to look at the greater good and the bigger picture to focus on forever I really hope I get an abundance of comments on this topic because I know I'm not crazy. I know I'm not the only one that's not shocked at all about what I'm hearing. The roles were reversed. They're happy. Toby had his process. Fat had her process. And in between both of them working on themselves and figuring out their process, they came together for something great and phenomenal that everyone wishes to have. Let it go and let them live because I promise they have and they ain't losing no sleep behind any of this. That's going to conclude tonight's episode of Building That Vlog Life. Like, comment, share. Holler back at your boy. And I'm talking about A.